Hello, hello, everybody. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. How are you? Fine. Fine. Thank you. Good. Okay. You're welcome. Okay. Awesome. Thank you very much for joining today's session. Okay, give me the okay. second here. Okay, there we go. Okay, so this is uh, the last uh, session, right? The last class of the week. So thank you guys because hemos estado acá pendientes toda la semana. I guess I have seen you all. We have a donate today, Mr. Molina, Yvette, Emerson, Blanca, Natalie, Lisette. So thank you very much. Recuerdo desde el día uno hemos estado acá. So thank you. That is awesome. Que sigamos prosperando, right? Um, y aprendiendo. That's really important. So today vamos a trabajar a little bit uh, with... Um, just a second. I'm going to be sharing my screen. Okay, hold on. I'm going to be sharing my presentation here. Okay, so um, this is pretty much what we will be doing today. We are going to be able to identify some health issues, health problems, and also we will give some uh, recommendations, right? This belongs to uh, session number two. So, algunos mencionaron que ya estaban trabajando con la sesión número dos, all right? Y si todavía no hemos llegado acá, pues, you know, eh, les va a servir bastante para trabajar en la plataforma, right? So, this is what we will be doing. We are going to be working with some vocabulary, um, also speaking practice, and uh, vamos a repasar un poquito, like, how to give recommendations, okay? Um, first, I have a, a conversation here. This is about health problems. So let's get started. Uh, please activate your microphone. We are going to practice uh, pronunciation. So get okay. your microphone okay. ready. Okay. Yeah, ready. Perfect. We're ready. So we are going to repeat, okay? First, we have high how are you? How are you? Not so good. Not so good. Not good. I have a terrible cold. I have a terrible cold. cold. Terrible cold. Really? 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 That's too bad. That's, That's too bad. bad. That's too bad. bad. You should be at home in bed. You should, you should, be, should be, at be at home, home in bed. bed. Home in bed. bed. Really important to get a lot of rest. It's, it's really important, important to, to get, get a, lot a lot of, of rest. rest. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're, right. you're right. Have you taken anything for it? And have you, and have have you, you taken, anything anything for for it? It? You taken anything for it? No, I haven't. No, oh, I, I no, I haven't. Well, it's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. Well, well it's sometimes, it's sometimes helpful, helpful to eat, to eat garlic, garlic soup. Garlic Just chop up a whole head of garlic. Just chop up a whole head of garlic. 
and cook it in chicken stock. Try it. Try it. Try it. It right. really works. It really, it really works. Really works. Really works. Yuck. That sounds awful. Yeah. yeah. That sounds so awful. Exactly. So imagine garlic. Have you ever eaten garlic soup? Soup. Oh, no. no. Would you like to? Would you like to give it a try? No. No. <laughs> Now, okay, yeah. so that sounds awful, right? So yes. it's like, oh, Jack. Okay, so this is like the recommendation that a person has for a cold, right? When you're yeah. nasing, okay, when you have sometimes like sore throat. So these are the type of uh, health problems that we are going to be checking today, okay? So okay. let's take a look at sure. some. Oh. All right, let's take a look at the way um, the person gave recommendations. Uh, the person said, what should I do for a call? So if you remember, for recommendations we can use, you should. Um, you should um, get garlic soup. You should drink a lot of water. Um, water. You should take medicine. Mm -hmm. Any other recommendation for a cold? What should I do for a cold? Take a rest. Okay, you should take a rest. What else? Drink so Maybe. much water. All right, so you should like drink uh, as much water as you can. Anything else? Any other? So should is one way to give recommendations. The other way, you know, um, it's using this ones right here. So we can say it's important. Oh, it's important to get a lot of rest. Um, it's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. Um, and it's a good idea to take some vitamin C. So by using these expressions, you are giving recommendations. It's important, it's sometimes helpful, and it's a good idea. And um, of course, the other way is using should. You should. So first, let's get familiar with some illness, okay? Some health problems. So you can give recommendations in a couple of minutes. First, um, this is the question that we have. What's the matter? So what's the matter? It's like, ¿cuál es el problema? What's the matter? What's wrong? There are two ways. If you want to ask, ¿qué te pasa? Okay, like, ¿cuál es el problema? You can use what's the matter and you can use what's wrong. So let's take a look at some questions. I mean, at some health problems. Take a look at this. What's the matter? Can you help me? What is the name when you have a pain in this area? How do you call this? How can you say dolor en la espalda? Any idea? Uh, Hillard, something like this, I don't know. Uh, okay. Okay. Backage. Uh, all right. So if you check, this is your back. Okay. You okay. can say, I have a pain. Tengo dolor. I have a pain in my back. And it's okay. Pain. Or you can use the word ache to, to, uh, to mean dolor as well. So how do we do it? First. I say the part of the body, in this case, back, okay, this part, y luego le agrego a back ache. So this back is ache. back ache. And what I'm saying is, oh, tengo dolor de espalda. So you can say, uh, this is, I have a back ache. Now, this a is cake. ache, okay, ache, the dolor. Mm -hmm. So I have a back ache, all right? This is the first health um, problem. Let's take a look at this one. Oh, take a look at this. How do you say diente? How do you call this? Tooth. Tooth. Hey, very good. So I have tooth. Y le agrego ache. So I have a toothache. Okay, I have a toothache. So me duelen los dientes, right? I have a toothache. Me duele el diente. All right. Um, let's take a look at the following. If you check, the part of the body is the ear, okay? So, yeah. le, le agregamos yeah. 
earache. Yeah. I have an earache. Okay. That's earache. earache. Yeah. Or I have a earache. pain in my ears. I have an earache. Let's I have, have an earache. I have an earache. I have an earache. I have an earache. I have an earache. Very good. Now let's take a look at this. Oh, how do you call this part? Headache. I have a headache. Head, okay, headache, exactly. Headache. I have a pain in my head or I have a headache, exactly. So let's take a look at the following. All right, what about this one? It's stomach. It's stomach. 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 Very good, it's a stomach, stomach. and then a stomach cake. So I have a stomach cake. I have a stomach cake. Not a stomachache, right? But I have a stomachache. <laughs> okay, so this is the uh, the stomach, right? Um, all right, so take a look at the following. Oh, poor man, okay? So what's the matter? What's wrong with you? Oh, a cold. So if you check, uh, maybe you, he has temperature, uh, he's drinking a lot of water, maybe he has a headache. So a cold or a flu. So puede tener gripe, right? That's cold or flu, and you can say I have a cold or I have flu. So tengo I have, tengo un I have, flu. I have a flu. I have flu. Um, oh, this one. This is like when you are sick, cold. okay, and you're like <coughs> exactly, cold. exactly. So this is called a cough. So a yes, cough. Mm -hmm. so like <coughs> this is a cough. All right. So I have a cough. Tengo. Um, Cough. Cough. Thank you. Tos. Exactly. Okay. Mm. Now, no, this, no, 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 no. if you take a look, the person is like, oh, no, I'm going to vomit. Okay. So you awful. can say, I feel sick. Oh, or also, this is awful. So, okay, horrible. Okay. But in, in general, you can say, I feel sick. So, I sick. feel sick is very general to say, quiero vomitar, me siento mal, me siento enfermo. All right. So, I feel sick. Do you feel sick right now? No. No. Are you sick? No. no. A little bit. No, I don't. I, I have a cold. Oh, you have, I have a cold. cold. <laughs> oh, you have a cold as well. All right. Uh, what about a backache? Do you have a backache? No, I don't. No. No. A toothache? No. No. Ache? No. No. Uh, no. no. Okay. Okay, so probably just, um, it's the weather, right? That we get sick, yes. that we get the flu, or we get the cold, all right? Um, we have this other picture. If you check, the guy is like, oh, you yeah. know. So this dizzy. is dizzy, exactly. Dizzy. So dizzy, when you like, oh, are around and, and, and you get dizzy. So está totalmente mareado, all right? Dizzy. So dizzy, he's dizzy. I feel dizzy, okay? He feels dizzy. Dizzy. Dizzy, exactly. Dizzy. He feels a little dizzy. This is the one that I have that is this. Cough is, <coughs> but this is the pain, okay? So this is like when you have a pain here in this part of your body. So this or is called, this is your throat. So the pain so, is sore throat. Sore throat. throat. Sore throat. Or I have sore, sore throat. I have. So, no, it's not coronavirus. Sorry. No, 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 no. Of course not. It's not the coronavirus. It's only a symptom. <laughs> okay, so, um, well, if you pay attention, the throat is the name, garganta. But sore is like, como lastimado, right? So I have a sore throat. <coughs> Uy, who is sick? Oh. Who is coughing? <laughs> okay. Escuché a alguien tosiendo. I heard someone coughing. Yeah. Okay. That's me. <laughs> oh, so oh, you're a little sick. I'm sorry about it. <laughs> okay. So let's take a look at this. Let's repeat. Number one. Sore throat. Sore throat. Sore throat. 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 Next one. Cough. Oh. Next one, stomachache. 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 Next one, earache. Earache. Headache. 
So these are the most common health problems. Of course, there are more, but they are the most common that we can have, all right? Um, so for example, now with the coronavirus, um, I heard that you have, for example, a cough, a sore throat, a flu, right? A, what else? Headache, yeah. I believe. Diarrhea. Yeah. Oh, oh yes. diarrhea. Diarrhea. Okay. Yeah. Fever. Fever is not here, fever. but you get also fever. Okay, like high temperature, um, etc. Yeah. So they are just examples. But I have a little exercise for you. And this one says, <laughs> give recommendations for the following health problems. All right. We are going to uh, make some groups. Okay. And so you have the opportunity to practice. Um, I want you to choose uh, some health problems and give recommendations. For example, um, I feel dizzy. What should I do? What is the meaning of dizzy? Mariado. So I feel dizzy. What should I do? What are your recommendations? You should take a seat. Okay, okay, very good. What else? No, no move and stand by. Okay, so you shouldn't move. Okay, no move you should by. sit down. Uh huh. Sit down and take it easy and breathe. Oh, a that's long important. Breath. Okay, so take, okay, so breathe. Exactly. Right. So we are going to give some recommendations. You think you should. It's a good idea. Okay. And the grammatical aspects that I introduced at the very mm -hmm. beginning. So we are. Some. Give me just a second. Let me make some groups so you can practice. If you think um, it is easier to write, to write the ideas in, on your notebook, um, do it. It's okay. But if you can do it orally, so perfect. That's awesome. Okay. So please join the groups. And now I will give you five minutes so you can practice. Okay. Okay. And then uh, I will bring you back i will tell you back uh, so there we go one two and three
propio ser, des, desmayar, ¿no? Y when, when someone has a this is the first step to teacher, how do you say desmayar? That faint. The same. Faint. Let me share the spelling. Because the, this is the first step to the same day. Yes, normally um, dizzy is only the feeling, right? This is uh, mareado, but sometimes uh, people faint. So that is the faint. word faint. Mm -hmm. Faint, okay. Faint. Thank you, faint. Faint. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank also, you. I, I think that you should uh, bring, uh, how do you say lento? <laughs> Slowly. Slowly. Uh -huh. slowly. Slow, slowly. Slowly. No. You should oh, slowly. No, no, it's slowly. Mm -hmm. Slowly, okay. Slowly. So, so, so you can shoot, no, you should bring slowly. That is good. That is okay. Yeah. Bring, uh -huh. like, respirar. Are you discussing right. when you feel easy? Yeah. Every day, if you can breathe slowly, you can, I don't know. <laughs> um, breathe slowly. Yeah, breathe slowly, faint, sit down, right? Um, or Drink some water. Probably drink some water, okay? And call the doctor, right? If we don't know what to do. So <laughs> yeah. <is> <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it is important. Um, what about the other? problems because let me see what is the other you have what should i do for a fever emerson fever you can fever. drink soap chicken soup or bolo soup maggie soap i don't know maggie soap. <laughs> <laughs> My chorizo. one for the muertos right <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, okay, that's a really good recommendation. Just a little something. Esta palabrita eh, se confunde bastante con otra. Let me write it down. Uh -huh, exactly. So, you have this one that is like a magi, right? And yeah. you have this one que es el jabón. So, the pronunciation. <laughs> yes. So this is soup. Como una U. Soup. And this one is como una O. Soup. Okay. So, mm -hmm. so we take soup and we take a shower with soap. Mm -hmm. okay. So, se tienden a confundir bastante, all right? Yeah, thank so, you. No soup. problem, soup. you're fine. Soup, soup. So, in this case, for a fever, that would be take a Maggie soup, all right? Or a maruchan. I don't know. I don't think a maruchan. Yeah, <laughs> maruchan. <laughs> so, survivor. <laughs> Yeah, definitely. Okay, you're doing a really good job. Give me just a second. Let me go for the, let me share, let me take a look at the other groups, how they are doing, all right? So let's okay. keep on practicing. Very good job. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello, hello. I have the problem. Oh, what's the problem, Blanca? I have not a, a no problem a, a, no problem um sore throat DC and DC and and go. Uh, so what is the, the problem? problem? Oh you are talking about them. You are talking about a, having a sore throat. Sí, yo lo que quería decir era que ahorita no tenía problemas de salud. Ah, sí. oh, so you solo, say, solo, solo un poquito de tos, pero por la lluvia. Yeah, yeah, me too. No es COVID, no es COVID. I, no, um, I mean, thank God, because I guess because of the weather, we get uh, allergies. So um, that's why we are coughing, right? Oh, and Yvette is sick as well. Sorry about it. Okay. I'll be it's better. On, it's only okay. okay. Yeah, it's it's like um some like uh, allergic. 
Uh, okay, yeah, I guess it's because of the weather. So, um, well, but I'm glad you're healthy. Brenda, what about you? And I, I have a, a cough. Oh, are you yes. taking anything? Are you taking medicine? Yes, I, I have to, um, I have to take a therapy all night oh. because I have a, a bronchial problem. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. So you are in treatment. Yeah, and so uh, with the weather, it's 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 worse for me. Complicated. Yes. Oh, okay. Okay. So, uh, what about for Yvette and Blanca? They have a cough. Is it a terrible cough or just like um, light problem? Mm. Um, I I show how a tea. Mm, okay, okay, so a tea, maybe a chamomile tea? Yes. No, a manzanilla? Manzanilla. Chamomile, mm -hmm. cinnamon. Chamomile. Como digo manzanilla, teacher? Chamomile, and then we go back, all right? Okay. Give me just a second. Okay. Uh, Hello. Hello. How Hi. are you? <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, teacher, one question. Sorry. Tell me. What is your name? Hey, my goodness. Hello, I'm you. sorry. <laughs> my name is Julia. Ah, okay. Es que aparece inglés corporativo, entonces como que... Uh. I know, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, Julia, okay. yeah, no, no cambio the nombre. Yes, but my name is Julia Sarceño. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. Okay, yeah. Well, actually, in station number one, I aparece like my, my full name there. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, so tell me, guys, ¿cómo vamos? Do you have any question or everything's fine? Yeah, then I have a question to how, um, how to... to do the the answer i think that is do you have a headache or do you have a stomach or stomach pain? um so what you want to know is how to organize the the answer is that your question like the structure how la, or la estructura de las respuestas okay well uh, first, depende qué es lo que queramos decir, right? It depends. Let me go back. Uh, give me a second. Le voy a compartir acá rapidito eh, algunos ejemplos de cómo podemos hacerlo, right? Um, first, podemos usar should or shouldn't. So, para indicar qué es lo que usted debería de hacer. Remember that should es usted debería. Estoy dando una recomendación, no es obligación. Por ejemplo, Si tengo eh, a stomach ache, imagine I tell you, hey, uh, Roxana, I feel really bad. Um, I have a terrible stomach ache. Y viene usted y me dice, oh, okay, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, pero deberías de tomar, por ejemplo, I don't know, Pepto-Bismol, probably. So, hay varias formas. Puede utilizar alka este. Oh, okay, alka -Seltzer. So, you can say, um, you, you should buy an alka -Seltzer. Y, y está bien, so should es tú deberías, all right? Otra forma de hacerlo es con estos. Oh, it is important to get a lot of rest. For stomach ache, tal vez eh, deberías de tomar mucha agua. So it's important to uh, drink a lot of water, okay? Or si tengo dolor de cabeza, for example, debería de tomar acetaminophen, right? Um, so it's important to take a pill, or it's important to take acetaminophen, or it's important to take a painkiller. O puede usar la siguiente que dice, it's sometimes helpful. So, a veces ayuda. The person here está recomendando una sopa de ajo, right? It is sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. So, algunas veces ayuda. Or, puedo decir, it's a good idea to take some vitamin C. For example, Eh, teníamos dentro de los problemas, right, eh, un dolor de espalda. So, yo le puedo decir, well, primero no debería tomar un masaje, right? No debería de hacer ejercicio físico. Also, you shouldn't 
uh, do any sort, any type of exercise. Usted no debería. Or, puede utilizar estos. It's important uh, to see a doctor. Okay. Um, no sé si... And it's possible to, to do a question in negative. Yeah, sure. En este caso, si yo voy a utilizar should, lo puede hacer negativo de una sola vez. Shouldn't. Like, no debería. Shouldn't I. Como son recomendaciones, right? Es como si le pregunta, ¿no debería de yo hacer esto? Like, um, no debería de tomar, eh, let me see. For example, I have a toothache. Vengo yo y le pregunto, ¿no debería de... de no sé, de golpearme contra la pared, por ejemplo, para que se me quite. So, shouldn't I hit the wall? Okay. Sí se puede, pero utilizando de una sola vez la contracción acá de should con no. Shouldn't I or shouldn't you. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, yes, yes, it is possible. Guys, give me just a second. Eh, me necesitan en otro room. Regreso en un segundo. Si tienen más dudas, let me know, please. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you teacher. You are welcome. Hello. Hello. So I came the fastest I could. Tell me. Necesitaban ayuda por acá. Is everything fine? Es que pensamos que se había olvidado de nosotros. No, oh, como que en los first. <laughs> no, no, no. I, was, I was checking. Los chicos por ahí tenían un par de dudas. Yeah. Um, so, ¿cómo, ¿cómo vamos? Uh, are you finished? Yeah. Did you give recommendations yes. for the health problems? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Perfect. No, como me voy a olvidar de ustedes. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay, so, okay, tell me, um, for example, what are the most common health problems that you have? Do you normally get a headache, a stomachache, a toothache? What are the for most me, common? stomachache. Okay, stomachache. Yes. That's the only one, is it? Yes. Okay. All right. Tatiana, what about you? Mm. Pues, no me, no suelo enfermarme de nada. <laughs> <laughs> so you're a healthy person. Yeah. Oh, really? So not even, mm. uh, the most common are cold. Not even a cold? ¿Cómo? Cold, like, un resfriado. So, not even a cold, ni siquiera un resfriado. Not even a cold. Pero es raro, allá como a los seis meses. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, so you're healthy. Están listos? Are you ready for the presentation? Ah, yes. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because Or, in my, in my, my, my part is easily... <laughs> Because, oh, come on. <laughs> I, am, I am depression. <laughs> but how many symptoms do you have? Only one. Uh, and at this moment, only practice one, one symptom. For, for I, I, I can't sleep at night. Oh. I have insomnia. Oh, okay. So you're having a sleep. For example. Uh, yeah, tell me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, go ahead. But I don't know if necessary to to say different uh, symptoms. Um, if, for example, if you cannot sleep at night, you can mention um, I have a headache during the day. I have terrible okay. headaches. It's something related, right? Something related to the previous topic or I don't know any other symptom that you can think of. Okay. Or I, I okay. am angry all the time. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Best example. I invented. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Okay. Okay. Thank yeah. you, teacher. A second. We will go back in a, in a second. Um, I'll have only. I will give you more minutes so you can uh, practice. Okay. Okay, teacher. Uh, for me.
Hello, hello. I guess all, oh no, we are missing some people. How was your practice? Are we almost ready? Mm, it was great. <laughs> oh, okay, awesome. <laughs> I, I, was, I, I had only the opportunity to listen to one pair. Okay, so um, I, I hope you were able to practice. So yeah. can, can I have two volunteers? One will be the doctor and the other person will be the patient. So obviously, I mean, uh, think of the, the possible symptoms, okay? And make the map, so invent and sell it, okay? <laughs> so make okay. the job of, um, of this doctor, make the, the work, you know, difficult. <laughs> make it difficult for the doctor. So uh, volunteers or victims, what do you prefer? Oh, what? What? What do you need, teacher? Oh, uh, both actually, volunteers or victims? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, anybody else? We we were uh, spoken with Blank about the sugar label. Oh, okay. Would you like to to role play it for us? Would you yes, like to be volunteer? Okay, thank you. Yes. Mm -hmm. Blanca, Blanca would you like to I I don't know Blanca, but is Blanca a uh, she was the the patient and me the doctor. Perfect. Please you know. help us. Blanca Excellent doctor. <laughs> Excellent doctor. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hey, come on, Blanca. Come on with my my clinic. Clinic, right? Uh, appointment. Appointment. Yes. Could appointment you... is for para citas, right? Mm -hmm. Cita, right? Yes. Okay, so Blanca, if you are ready, we can get started. Start. What is your problem, Blanca? Yeah, health problem. Could you please explain your health problem? Se desconectó, Blanca. <laughs> uh, okay, maybe she's feeling better now. <laughs> yeah, maybe we lost okay. her. Okay, don't worry, that's okay. And anybody would like to be a patient for Mr. Molina? Hi. Thank you, Miss Velas. Please. Okay, Luis Molina. Hey, uh, good, you, evening. good evening. Good uh, evening. My my problem heard is I have problem for for sleep. I can sleep at night. I have insomnia and sometimes insomnia. I have a headache. 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 Okay, it's it's very important that oh you should uh, you should do the exercise a lot of exercise every day. And don't forget, uh, take you should take this pill for your headache. And uh, it's very important to uh, 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 you should you should go you should to go the bed earlier. That is correct. Yeah. Yes, continue. <laughs> You're doing a good job. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 All right, very good. So you should do exercise. You a lot of exercise. A lot of exercise and okay. You I don't forget take your pill. Oh, okay. So and you should... respect you respect your receipt. Okay. Oh, okay. So exactly, uh -huh. that's important also to take. Somebody said before you should take the pills on time. So on it's time. important to respect the schedule of the fields, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good, yeah. Okay. Thank you, hey, very good job. <laughs> okay. Thank you. I cannot clap it here, but, um, oh yes, we have emojis, so yes, there we go. <laughs> okay, very good job, that was nice. Um, let me see if we have time. We have like one minute, anybody else? So we can finish? A question. Yes. How, yeah. how do you say um, okay. um, cita para el doctor? Oh, sure. Um, here, I'm going to share the... 
Mm -hmm. Here. Um, right here. I don't know if you can see my screen. It says you're having an online appointment. So appointment is una cita. But in términos de, de doctores, right? Doctors, dentists, uh -huh. so this is an appointment. So, lo que estaban teniendo today es como un modo, una cita virtual, an online appointment, right? Como les mm -hmm. que están haciendo ahorita el seguro social. Okay. So, that was the one. Okay, very good job. So, that was pretty nice. Um, I'm so sorry, I cannot one. see the time here. I have a question to teach. Tell me, Roberto. Uh, how do you say jarabe? It's a syrup. Uh, I'm going to, yeah, I am going to type it in the chat. Uh, there you are. Okay. So, um, yes, yeah. like for example, when you have a sore throat, uh, it's very common that you get it, right? Um, I cannot remember the names, but you get syrup. Also, you can get uh, pills, so las pastillas, right? Pills? You can get pills. Mm -hmm. Or, depending on, okay. for example, los ojos, so you can get some drops, all right? Oops, so, gotita, drops. right? You can get some drops, yes. So, um, uh, if I'm not wrong, I guess that our time is over. Am I correct? Yes, guys. Yeah, all right. So, sorry. time is over for us. Yeah, I'm sorry about it. But, como vamos, no nos vamos a ver hasta el día lunes, right? Um, yeah. So, les voy a dejar una tarea súper pequeñita, que investiguemos cinco nombres de las enfermedades que ustedes normalmente sufren, o puede ser los síntomas, right? ¿Qué es lo que les pasa? A I mí, mean, yo sé que son muy, muy uh, healthy, que son saludables, pero de vez en cuando nos duele, por ejemplo, I don't know, tenemos dolor en, en, lo, en el cuerpo, por ejemplo, ¿cómo se dice dolor de cuerpo? O um, me duele... I, I don't know, ¿qué es lo que les duele? Por ejemplo, how do you say uh, diarrea or cosas bien comunes que nos puedan suceder, right? So, eh, mm -hmm. investiguémosla, check it out, y nos vemos el día lunes y las compartimos como parte del vocabulario, all right? Okay. So, okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you everybody. Thank no you se les so olvide much. trabajar Thank en you. la plataforma. See you on Monday. Have a nice weekend. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. You too. Thank you. Bye. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Good night.